Several other demonstrations going on in Connecticut, mostly peaceful. They're all speaking out against police brutality. Today, a large crowd of young people brought their concerns once again to the state capitol. Our chief capitol reporter, Susan Raff, is there live now with what happened earlier today. Susan? Dennis, we're seeing quite a few demonstrations here in Connecticut, and yes, they have been mainly peaceful protests. In fact, just a few minutes ago, teachers here in Hartford started gathering at the state capitol. Their message, like all the others, Black Lives Matter. But a much bigger crowd this afternoon, a crowd of more than 300 people, students organized this one. No justice, no peace, no justice, no peace. The students who organized the rally here at the state capitol this afternoon were from Central Connecticut State University, mainly the Black Student Union and the student government. But there were a lot of students from all over the state who felt it was very important to be here. Their message is one of unity. They want to make sure that people understand that we are all human beings and that we should be treated as human beings and that the color of our skin shouldn't matter. The students also made a clear message or a clear point of saying that when it comes to police officers, not all police officers are bad, but they feel that all police officers would benefit if they listen and have more empathy. The time is now. There is no other there's no other answer. We want justice. We want it now. We deserve to live in a world where everyone, including black people, are created equal. That's what we all say in the Constitution. So why isn't that happening? Man, we're going through a lot. We're going through a lot of change right now. We just need something to change permanently, not just for now. We don't want it to be in the news for now. We want it to change forever. So this is a movement that hopefully can impact a lot of people, no matter what the race is, and change it forever. The students who held the rally here at the state capitol left the capitol. They rallied around Bushnell Park and then ended up at City Hall. We've been hearing a lot from young people today. Yesterday, we were at Cromwell High School, a, mar a march organized by young people who want to be heard and want change to happen. Many of these students also are making a point of saying that they are against the looting. They feel it's destructive and it is hurting their message and they want it to stop because they feel that it is working against them and creating more violence and division. We are live in Hartford at the State Capitol, Susan Raff, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.